Alright. So does it say anywhere on these? No. Maybe that person can help us. Hey, weren't you that hot detective with the cool ride? What happened to you, man? You look awful. No, oh, thanks. Don't you remember? He questioned me about a case a few years ago. He had a little toy robot taking notes for you. Oh. And you were always hanging out with that really good looking Jane. Cute brunette number. Whatever happened to her? It's probably the um, other lady that was on the picture. Because uh, Fatima's a blonde. Who's this? Nick Plum. I'm supposed to be going to my girlfriend's house, but if I wait 10 more minutes, an Akarax will rearrange itself, placing her closer to me, so I don't have to travel as far. <laughs> you gotta be smart and think ahead when traveling on an Akronox. It's just hard giving directions. Oh. Well, that's good advice, because I need directions. Frank's flop house. There we go. Vertigo. Here. Now. So dizzy must breathe deep. I try to walk up the sloped green graph path that leads to Casanox just around this corner, but as soon as I felt myself walking up the wall, I panicked and kicked off. Oh. The relative gravity system is madness. When I look up and see people walking on the ceilings, it just breaks my mind. It reminds me too much of, of Madeline. What? The key is to say on the same plane. Oh. That doesn't look good. Looks like a mugger. Let's have a look around this area first. I saw someone in the corner there. Let's go to the fountain. There it is. Faz Burble Man. Do you have the package? Oh wait, uh, nothing. Just uh, waiting for my wife. Nothing suspicious here. Move along, citizen. Hey, right. this looks like it's the fountain. That's pretty. Some fountain, huh? I just call it that because no one knows what else to call it. Look around you. These buildings and architecture were already here when an Akronox was discovered 80 odd years ago. Just imagine finding an entire city planet the size of a moon and nobody's home. When it became clear the original population wasn't coming back, people moved right in. Mostly fugitives on the run. Yep. Yeah, that is weird. Nobody worried about that. What about this little fling bot? I fling things for a buck. I'll fling your trench coat for a buck. That's right. I'll fling anything for a buck. Doesn't matter the shape or size. I'll fling it right over the rail for a buck. <laughs> I'll fling myself down there for a buck. <laughs> I think it's illegal to throw things down the fountain, dude. Are you serious? <laughs> the short lived life of the fountain. So that's pretty interesting, he's definitely on some different gravitational thing. And here's something we can't quite reach, so let's come back for that as well. Um, oh, and now we're here. So this is all just one area. Ooh. So, probably first battle, real battle I mean. Ugh, that was painful. Oh damn, I should have probably healed. I... Oh damn. Well. <laughs> hmm. Yes. Yes. Um. Also save, eh?
Kill me again. Boom. Ha. <laughs> yeah. Should have thought of that sooner. Gained thousand experience, a hundred bucks, and a heal grease plus. I can use that. Um. And I'm all healthy now. What is this? Bleh. Bugs are crawling on that thing. Right. That is the graph pad that makes that the dude feel sick. So. Those are the things that allow you to. Walk on the ceilings and stuff. So what's this? What did he look like? Bandana and ponytail, I think. I don't remember. It happened so fast. I'm think pretty sure he was shirtless and his nipples were pierced. And I think I caught a whiff of spasm perfume. Hmm. Did you notice anything funny about his eyes? Now that you mention it, one eye was completely red. Yeah, we met those dudes. Then he's a member of the Junkyard 20 gang. Their numbers have grown ever since the Sacred Fools disbanded after the sewer wars. <laughs> Admission to the Junkyard 20 demands a painful rite of passage. They hollow out the inductee's left eye with a gory and heat fork and some disinfection acid. Ooh. I doubt we'll find your purse, ma'am, but I'll see what we can do. Thank you, officer. You're so unbelievably nice for an ox guard. Would you like me to walk you home, man? Heavens no, my dog would disown me. Now that's high like comedy, folks. Hey, shut up. <laughs> They're warning women to, women to avoid loitering warning near transition. Transition major of flight section C, D, E, and F will commence in 15 seconds. There's a purse snatcher who makes his move when the city plates change. He snags the purse at the last Please second, then makes the good his escape by hopping a ride on for a moving plate. plate Which makes you hope he slips up Stand and gets cut in half someday. Okay, yeah. Use the elevator. Down. Hmm. Let's save our game again. After we managed to uh, finally beat that dude. Oh, that was so stupid. I'm going to kill him. 
okay. Ooh, that was time minded. Maria Black. No, wait. First, I'm gonna take all his money. Then I'm gonna kill him. My father deserved better. Simon Lange must die for what he did. Too bad his address isn't listed on Sendernet. If only I knew where he lives, I could avenge the death of my father. This is the Fountain Overlook, so there we go. I know secrets. Lots of them. We could share a few if you've got any to spare. Look, you little beefer. I know every Stulola from here to the reservoir, and you ain't a regular. Regardless, I know things. For example, one of Detta's crash doctors threw a private dick out a window today, just a few blocks away from here, flung like a rag doll. So you heard about that, huh? Big deal. You gotta do better than that if you want to impress me. Your first pet was a miniature spitzer named Earl. <laughs> What's your rate, Junker? Strictly a quid pro quo arrangement. I believe the free exchange of information should be the goal of every civilized society. Don't you think? Keeps everyone just a little more honest. So I gotta share my dirt with you before you'll sprinkle any of your own, huh? That's the idea. I'll be here for the next few hours if you have any inquiries, detective. Cool, so we met the informant, who definitely seems to know a lot. Yep. So, if we get any information or we need anything, we can uh, find him here. Off to the Casanox area. Casino? I'm not sure how it's pronounced. Oh, a love scarred. You seen this woman? That is the woman, um, yeah, uh, who's part of the revolution. So, uh, no, no, we haven't. Because uh, those Nox guards work for Detta, don't they? Nope, nope, never seen. Right, run along. I will. Here we are, platform area and Aquinox tools. What's that? I saw something. Someone's on fire just around the corner. <laughs> this area's closed off until he puts himself out. <laughs> okay. That's a clever way of uh, uh, barring me to go to some game areas. So. We're going to Frank's flop house, so that's right there. There's also the junkyard area, tenements and gallas. Yeah, gallas area. Oh, I've got a little time minder eating his lunch. Gala Creature Repair and Fairy Plastic. Cool. Steel Dot the Fruta. Sorry. The Fruta is not for sale. <laughs> what is this then? For display only. Okay, sorry. Delicious Fruta. Yeah. <laughs> Why not? There's nothing in your shop I want. Let's check out Gallus. Don't touch anything. Creature repair. That's cool. There's something wrong with my bot, man. It's not the engine, not the wiring, not the circuitry. I don't know what's wrong with her. They better fix my baby. Looks a bit like the... Eh, slightly different. This is something we can use later. 
Did I ever tell you how she got into this business? She started her career as a cyberneticist. But when her son was nearly killed in a swerver accident, she devised a radical new grafting process to save him. It was a major advancement in traditional bio-melding techniques. Oof. Gal is a multi-millionaire, but she insists on working the shop herself, here on the Necronox of all places. She said something about the bricks needing her help most. Don't tell her I told you though. <laughs> Mom would kill me. You see this son? <laughs> Right. Uh, is this? Can I... oh. Hi. <sighs> Got stuck. Hi. Nice to see you alive in kicking boots. I was sure that I had you sent to Marble Town. Oh, cool. We can buy some heel grease here. How much money we got? A hundred and thirteen. Uh, I think we'll stick to regular heel grease for now. Time mind a tear. What's that there? Resurrect a deadish character and restore some hit points. Can't afford that, unfortunately. We'll probably get some. Let's get five heel grease. For now. Cool. I will. Something tells me this will be one of my favorite shops. Nothing else. Ooh, look at that. Found a taco. I wonder if it, yeah, collectibles is now added. So, got one. So there's 20 of those spread around the entire game to find. Uh, these are other collectibles you can find later. Get quests for them. They're super hard to find them. My stupid kid broke his arm trying to reach a bite tree working on a construction strut. Hmm. Poor kid. Little brat. <laughs> it's a great parent. Up we go. I'll save again. I oversave again. You there. Eddie knows. Okay. See all those little gub bugs? They breed on the warm underbelly of those conductor pipes and mold under the grating before coming up to search for, for food. Careful where you step. The brebulans have an old saying. Step on a gub, your life will stub. <laughs> well, something gets lost in the translation, but you get the point. It's bad luck, man. Ugh. Great. So he's a bug lover, is he? Oh, God, I didn't see them. Uh, I'm gonna kill one of them. Yeah. Hope I can get more of those soon. Boom. Boom. Ugh. At least he doesn't hit as hard as that other one did. Oh no! Oh, he's doing it. He missed. Ha! Warning. Ha, ha. Transition minor plate, plate sections 32, 33, 33 11, 11, and 6 and will commence, commence in 15, 15 seconds. seconds. Oh, I missed. I'm being Please set on fire. Area. The district of South Akronauts is not Ow. liable for injury or death Ow. resulting that from plate hurts. transition. Yes. Stand by. Now I'm on fire too. Transition complete. Ha! Does that go away? Yeah. Oh, 
Oh, I've got some. Oh, got two more of my grenades. Awesome. Can't understand what these aliens are saying. Those are bugs again. Okay. What's this? Transition plate 27 is currently unaligned. Please keep this area clear in the event of a transition. The district of South Anachronance is not liable for injury or death resulting from plate transitions. So we saw that in the opening sequence, we saw um, parts of the planet shift and move. And that's what's going on here. <laughs> Tenements, Frank Flophouse. Eddie knows. Let me just check if I need anything. River. Oh, just use a regular heal, please. You remind me of a guy in my precinct. He's different from the rest of the Nox guards. He wears a leather jacket over his uniform and a pair of jeans. He's got his own set of rules, testing the limits of the law with his own brand of street justice. And I hate him. So get away from me before I take it out on your face. <laughs> Sounds like every Hollywood detective ever. What about you? Nice you. If I was gonna kill myself, this is where I jump from. People take the one-way dive from up here all the time. It happens pretty often around here. Really, the only thing stopping me from taking the plunge myself is the new Meatles album coming out ne next month. I gotta hear it. Gotta love the Meatles. Uh, how do we get to Frank's Flop House? What's this? Didn't I warn you about loitering in front of Joe's? Don't talk back to me, son. Hey. That's how you gotta handle these brebulence. So those are brebulence. They're as stubborn as they are stupid. What did you say to me? That's right. I didn't think so. I have no idea what they said. No. This is not the right way to Frank's Flop House. Frank's Flop House. Warning. Transition major. Upgrade section C. D. E. Commence in 15 seconds. Please keep area clear. The district of South Africa is not liable for injury or death. There's a mysterious guy somewhere in the bricks named Eddie who knows things. You can never have enough contact, so keep an eye out. Yeah, I saw some graffiti earlier as well. Transition complete. All the way back upstairs. Oh. It's a pretty cool looking place, so. Tenement's lower area. This Frank's flop house. This is a navigator of sorts. You can talk to it and then give it like uh, one dollar or something, and it'll guide you to wherever you want to go. Yeah, for one loony, it'll lead you wherever. So you could just tell it, I want to go there, and uh, it'll go in front of you, and you have to let like, race after it. Now playing Miss Tech Pizza for a limited time only. <laughs> right, here's the Eddie Nose um, graffiti.
Uh, right, let's go into Frank's house.